Hey guys, how are you? I'm sure you guys are doing great. So guys, today in this video, I'm going to show you 10 commands which can help you troubleshoot any kind of network, any issues in your network. You can uh, troubleshoot with this uh, commands. So if you are working in IT field or maybe you are a network engineer, so you can use these 10 commands to troubleshoot or identify the issues and rectify yourself. To know all the 10 commands, watch this video guys till end. My name is Manjit Singh and you are watching your own channel. Tech Guru Majid. So let's to show you practically I have implemented one lab environment complete in network setup I have created so that I can show you practically. So to show you practically let me take you to computer screen there we will see what are these 10 commands and which commands is used for which type of issues. So we are on computer screen. So as you can see, uh, this is the network where I'm going to show you practically these 10 commands, which, which can help you to understand and troubleshoot the network. So let me open this router and uh, the very first command you can say uh, is very basic command, which is called ping command. So basically ping command is used to uh, identify or maybe the check the reachability between the two devices. So I'm on this router and let me see if my router is able to communicate with this uh, computer. The computer IP address is 192.168.10.2. So if I want to check the connectivity between uh, that router and uh, this computer, so what I have to write ping command, then after that uh, 192, the destination IP address, you can say 192.168.10.2. So if I hit enter, so uh, let me see if my uh, reachability between uh, these two devices are uh, you know available or not you, you can see the success rate is 80 percent uh, reason 80 percent because uh, the data has been transferred from this network first time so the first uh, packet of course drops uh, it is used for arp protocol and uh, rest you can see 80 percent now if i use again pay same command you can see i'm um, the success rate is 100 percent the second command is your trace route trace root so basically this trace root command can be used uh, let me say trace uh, root command so this uh, this trace root command can be used to identify the root so which root is used by uh, the network to transfer the user database so i am on this router so if i want to uh, check the uh, data going from this upper side network and the downside network so i am not sure about the which network is used to transfer my data if i if i want to know that so what i have to do uh, the trace root and the destination ip address so that destination ip address is your 192.168.10.2 again so you can see it will give you a complete detail so the first data reached to 70.1 which is your this this router second it is reached to 40.1 which is your uh, this upper side one the 50.1 this router and 20.1 this router and finally it reached the destination so you can see now i know that my data is transferred from the upper side network right this is the second command which you can troubleshoot right the third command you can say if i want to know about the interface status and the i complete uh, status so i will write show ip interface brief command so this command can give you a complete detail about the dev networking device so you can see the interface type the ip address and the status and the protocol so it can give you a complete detail about the device. So you can start from the uh, this end commands to troubleshoot the network. So the second command can give you show interface, right? Uh, show interface command can help you to understand in uh, detailed way, right? You can see each and every interface is uh, shown with complete detail. So here is the uh, interface which is fast Ethernet 0 slash 0. The status is up and the protocol is up also up and it is connected. Apart from that, it can give you a MAC address. It can give you a, your IP address including the uh, slash value. And apart from that, you can see MTU uh, bandwidth uh, allocated to this interface delay, uh, re reliability, uh, yeah, uh, the t uh, TX load and the RX load even you can check, right? So these are the uh, details available you, with this command. You can ch easily, uh, you know, uh, check your interface with more details. Uh, if you don't want the entire detail this way, you can use another command which is called I show IP interface. And uh, show IP interface can give you a 
lot more details you can see uh, the fast ethernet 0 0 is up and the protocol is up it is connected the interface ip address and apart from that it can give you also a broadcast ip address it can show you the broadcast ip address which can be used for this uh, network which was not available in the previous command the mtu is here the helper address is not set on this router you can see uh, the on this interface particularly the ip helper address is not configured what are the other facilities which are not configured on this uh, interface you can uh, check all the details with this command right so next command can uh, is your show protocol uh, show protocol sorry uh, protocol P R O protocol uh, show protocol command can give you a detail about if you don't want the entire detail of that particular interface not like this or not even like this and not even like this so uh, this command can give you only the, the basic detail which is very important for the network engineer to check the uh, interface type and status and the protocol type and uh, protocol uh, status apart from that it can also give you a ip address very short detail but very useful detail for the each and every network engineer say for example the next command next command is your i show ip protocol show ip protocol can give you a detail about the routing protocol configured on this uh, router so you can see uh, by this command you will get the complete detail about the routing protocol configured on that particular router so uh, the ospf 100 is configured uh, these are the two networks which are been uh, advertised and these are the gateways which can be used to transfer the data right so this command can help give you a control on the uh, you know routing protocol the next command is show ip route command sorry show ip route command can give you lot of information about each and every uh, you know network connected uh, the uh, with this router so you can see the entire detail of uh, the complete network is available in this 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 and uh, or you can see the eight uh, uh, networks are available 10 20 30 40 50 60 70 80 so by using this command show ip route you can uh, see the all network available in your that particular network the next command can give you a you know uh, help you to understand which is directly connected a network so you can use if you are uh, using if you are all the devices are uh, cisco then you can use show cdp neighbor command right so this command can give you a detail about you can see uh, one is router 4 and one is your switch right so you can see uh, one side uh, is switches connected one side is router is connected so this can give you a detail about the directly connected neighbors or if you are uh, uh, your devices are not from cisco and you can use this command show lldp uh, neighbors so lldp command can uh, give you a detail uh, same detail about the neighborship but this can only be help you in uh, when your devices are not uh, cisco or maybe you have a multiple companies device available in your network so in that case you can uh, enable this lldp protocol and you can use this command to check the neighborship directly ne connected neighbor the final uh, command which is very useful command which i uh, have shown in many videos in my troubleshooting videos which are available on my channel so which is show running configuration so basically whatever we will configure on our networking device the complete detail is available in this particular information so you can if you are uh, you know very confident about your troubleshooting skill you can if you are maybe a beginner or uh, you can use this command you it can give you a complete control on your see the interface type interface ip address the, the subnet mask and the duplex uh, speed like that and uh, you can see uh, the routing protocol which is configured and what are the network advertise in particular that so lot of information whatever you will configure on that particular router whatever the configuration is available the entire detail is available in this so this command can be used to troubleshoot your network so these are the 10 commands which i have shown you how you can check so let me uh, summarize this uh, all commands the first command i have shown you which is uh, the ping command 
second command I have shown you which is you can see uh, trace root command and the third command I have shown you that is show IP interface brief command and uh, fifth command uh, sorry fourth command is your uh, show uh, interface uh, show interface and the third fifth command is your show uh, IP interface and sixth command I have uh, shown you which is show protocol and the seventh command I have shown you which is show IP protocol and the eighth command I have shown you which is your show uh, CDP uh, show IP route sorry show IP route and the ninth command I have shown you show CDP uh, your neighbor or maybe you can uh, use this show LLDP neighbor command and the tenth command which is very useful which is show uh, running config right so running config uh, command can these 10 commands can help you uh, troubleshoot any kind of network so i hope uh, you have understood how you uh, what are the commands available to troubleshoot the network so guys i hope uh, this 10 commands will help you in troubleshoot your network so still you have any issues or any clarification any doubt do let me know in the comment section below so guys if you are uh, new to my channel don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to press the bell icon so that every time i upload the new video you will get notified so see you in the next video till then stay safe goodbye